Hello everyone, this is Aldrin Guerrero and welcome to Whiteboard Request. This time on Whiteboard Request, we're going to be doing Sunshine of Your Love by Cream. Now this is a request made by one of our UU Plus subscribers and I figured the song is perfect because it's a very iconic song with a very iconic riff. Alright, so let's get down to it. Let's learn Sunshine of Your Love. First, we're going to learn the chords for this song. All right, I'm going to show you the chords and I'm going to show you uh, different ways to hold these chords to make the transitions a little bit more smooth, okay? So first chord we're going to learn is a D chord. Pointer finger goes in the G string, 2nd fret. Middle finger, C string, 2nd fret. Ring finger, E string, 2nd fret. Now we have our C chord, A string, 3rd fret. Normally I would play this with my ring finger on the A string 3rd fret, but this time I'm going to use my pinky finger on the A string 3rd fret. And the reason for that is we're going to be switching between D and C a lot. So if I'm going to use my ring finger for the D chord, that means this ring finger has to hop over to play that C chord uh, really fast. But if I use my pinky finger, I can just do... kind of just switch off with my pinky finger there. I mean, I can still do it with my ring finger, but it takes a little bit more effort. So I want it to be more smooth and clean, so I use my pinky finger. Alright, next chord we're going to learn is an A chord. Middle finger goes on the G string 2nd fret, point of finger C string 1st fret. Next up we have a G chord. Point of finger, this time on the C string, 2nd fret, ring finger, E string, 3rd fret, middle finger, A string, 2nd fret. Next, we have an F chord, middle finger, G string, 2nd fret, and point of finger, E string, 1st fret. Now, I'm going to show you guys a little trick here. I'm going to use my ring finger for the E string 1st fret, and I'm actually going to let that go. So this is more like an F add 9, but it's going to give us an illusion of an F chord. So just like your F chord here. You know, it has a little bit of a difference in sound. But we need this chord shape to do that fast drum once again, because it's going to be... So if we're going to be doing, you can do that with the regular F that we showed you there, or you can just slide it down like this. Slide down your ring finger, let go of everything else, and then go back to that D chord. So just like that first part, you know, we need some fast changes. So you can either do that or go with the more traditional F. You can do that as well. All right, so now that you know all the chords to Sunshine of Your Love, we can move on and learn that iconic riff. All right, so for the riff, it sounds like this. All right, so nice and easy. A string, fifth fret. We're going to take our pointer finger, get that ready on the A string, third fret. We're going to follow the tap. So... A string 5th fret 2 times, 3rd fret, back to the 5th fret. And we're just going to shift this up so that ring finger, E string, 5th fret. And we're going to go down, ring finger on the 5th fret, middle finger on the 4th, pointer finger on the 3rd. So it goes like this. Pointer finger is going to go right on the C string 2nd fret from there. Ring finger goes on the C string 5th fret. Then back to the C string 2nd fret. So it sounds like this. If you want to add some attitude in there, you can kind of bend this a little bit on that C string 5th fret if you want. So it sounds like... I kind of bent it a little bit. Alright, nice.
nice and iconic. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a strumming pattern that kind of mimics that, all right? So let's take our left hand, place it over the strings, and with our right hand, we're gonna create kind of like that same rhythm pattern. So we're gonna do down, up, down, up, 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 down, up, down, up, down, up. Okay, so one more time. So if you uh, hum the that riff, it's gonna be kind of like your strumming pattern. And down, up, down, up, 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 down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, 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 down, up, down, up, down, up. So if you take a look at this, it's basically just down, up, down, ups, except for the two isolated up strums that you have there. So it goes like this. Down, up, down, up, 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 down, up, down, up, down, up. All right, so now that you have your strumming pattern, uh, we're gonna take that and kind of the rhythm pattern for the riff and add that to our chord pattern. So here are the chords for the song itself. We're gonna do a verse, and then we're gonna go to a chorus, and then we're gonna play a turnaround, which leads us, turns us around, back to the verse. Now, the turnaround is basically that, that riff. So, you know, we're gonna be doing the rhythm pattern for that riff. But let's go over the verse for now. Now, if you've noticed, we have some chords in parentheses, and that kind of follows more what the riff is doing, okay? But you can play the song basically just D, C, D, if you want, and follow it with that strumming pattern you just learned. So it goes like this. Down, up, down, up, up, up. Okay, now when we get to the chorus, is this gonna be a simple down, up, down on the A? And then down on the C, down on the G. One more time, down, up, down. Down, 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 down. Down, down, and it goes down, up, down, up, down. Just a nice little build up there. So nothing fancy, just like our, uh, our other strumming pattern that we use for the verse. The chorus, we didn't even bother to do the strumming pattern because it's a simple down, up, down. Down, 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 up, down. Down, 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 up, down. Down, 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 up, 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 down, up. And then which leads us to the turnaround. So now I'll show you the uh, the rhythm pattern that I was talking about. So remember when we did Our strumming pattern is gonna follow that a lot closer, okay? And we're gonna be using these chords. It's gonna be D, D, C, D, A, G, F, D, F, D. Okay, so it goes like this. Okay. Now, if you notice, that's just like the top part of our verse there. So the turnaround, you can play it once, you can play it twice, and then you can play it one more time as the first line of the verse, which would be D, D, C, D, A, G, F, D, F, D. But then when we reach the second line of the verse, you can just do the F, D right at the end. So it'll be like this, so. follows more the strumming pattern that you learned earlier, which is down, up, down, up, 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 down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, 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 down, up, down, up, down, up, Okay? And that's just F, D, and F, D. When it gets to the G, F, G, same thing. Back to the chorus. Now you can do the turnaround or you can substitute the riff for that. 
So if you want to give them that nice iconic riff, you can do that or you can fancy it up by using these full chords in order to play that same riff. All right, so you have pretty much everything you uh, you need. You have your chords, you have that picking pattern, you have your strumming pattern, you have your chord patterns. So that's pretty much everything you need to learn in order to play Sunshine of Your Love by Cream. This is Aldrin Guerrero. If you guys want more songs like this, whiteboard requests, and other tutorials, please check out ukuleleunderground.com. And while you're there, sign up for UU+. I'll see you folks next time. Aloha.